It's officially past 12 a.m. Eastern Time on December 15th, and Kanye West promised us a new album called Vultures with Ty Dolla Sign. But, as things seem, we've been in this rodeo before, and we don't have an album as of right now. So, in today's episode, Lou and I are going to be asking the question, where is this album and is it coming? Because, listen, there's still hope that it drops today. It's December 15th, and there's a massive live stream going on at apparently a rave in Miami. That's apparently costing people $2,000 to watch, so let's see how worth it it is, and (laughs) we're going to see if we end up getting an album after that. Or is it going to be coming after, apparently, Ye's performances with Ty Dolla Sign in Saudi Arabia? That was another big moment this week that kind of had the world shook because they were like, well, if he's doing all these live performances, does it mean he's performing the album that's already out? Or is he going to do like he did with Don then? He's going to drop it after. So, with that being said, we're still going to give you guys all the coverage on the entire Vultures rollout. Thank you guys so much for coming in today. And, Lou, how do you feel, man? 12 a.m. Eastern time. I'm not surprised. I mean, I told you since, like, even before the whole pre-save went up that this album was not going to come out this Friday. And what's interesting is that after Kanye confirming it, people were still hesitant. But once we got the pre-save links and once that track list appeared on streaming... (laughs) It said coming December 15th, you got all 18 songs listed, people actually had some fucking hope, and then all of that got shattered once the track list was actually removed from streaming, and now we're in the same boat that we've been in before, if you're a Kanye West fan, you know how it feels, an album gets announced and it doesn't end up dropping, but... For anyone who maybe isn't familiar with how these rollouts usually go, let me take you guys through how many days each Kanye West album has been late because, as you know, Ant, these... Uh, this, this is an infamous yeah, stat. Yeah, bro. Uh, this... You know, I think we actually pulled up the stat for the Donda session, so it's only right. It you is know? only right. Tradition. Absolutely. Okay, Tradition. so for Donda, it was 419 days late. Mm-hmm. Um, then we have The Life of Pablo, which was 531 days late. Graduation was 345 days late. Watch the Throne, 209 days late. College Dropout, 193 days late. Cruel Summer, 89 days late. Late Registration, 49 days late. Jesus is King, 28 days late. 808s and Heartbreak, one day late. And the only albums that came on time from Kanye were My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, Yeezus, Ye, and Kitsy Ghosts. So we find ourselves in the same situation. And at this point... Listen, we can't really speak about the music. I you know we both try to do a good job of staying away from the listening party he did in Miami. It's we, been tempting. Fajello on been Twitter very has been tempting. sending me all the snippets, and I'm trying to stay away as much as I can. So Obviously, I've heard the everybody snippet. I think yeah. everyone in the world has heard this snippet at this point. Um, classic Backstreet Boys sample flip. And uh, Mr. Kanye West, it's time to wake up. It's time to it's time to come at us with some new music. I mean, he's, uh, the, he's he, back. He, yeah, all absolutely. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we we want to see what's happening here, right? Because, I mean, listen, it's December 15th, and... We got a scheduled date. We had everything, but I think it was kind of uh, it was kind of scary when I think it was yesterday morning, right, or the day before, where uh, you went onto Apple Music and you went to the Spotify and like all the links kind of got torn down a bit, you know. Yep. And it was just like, what, what's going on now? You know, are they readjusting the track list? There was apparently rumors of like a, a Travis verse coming in late. That was some like rumors that I was mm. seeing circulating on Twitter. And I'm like, listen, man, you know, just uh, like the statistic you read, there is a clear like, if Vegas had to do a bet for this, you know where you'd put your money. You know, and, and you know where you'd go. I think people were a bit more optimistic this time just because Kanye himself said the album was coming out Friday. But even at that, you just you can't trust it, bro. At the end of the day, what I was going to get to talking about like the actual rave in Miami was the fact that we can't really judge if the music sounded unfinished or not because we didn't really check out too much of it. But my assumption is... The album's probably not done yet. He's probably still working on the track list. We know how meticulous he is when it comes to perfecting an album track list. And at this point, if that's the case where it's not perfected yet, fuck it. Drop it in 2024. I'm not even like... I'm not not mad at this. Not to say I'm not hyped about this album, but I could wait. If it needs to wait, push it back couple weeks a month two months i'm chilling well, right now, now you're starting to get into a danger zone because then there's a become a yandy situation that's where like you're let me now ask you're that asking that. questions do you think now this album like... could end up in the, in the bermuda triangle of kanye releases Oof. could it you know it was funny i was doing some tiktok content at one point and i had done uh, material on how you could create an entire discography for kanye west's long lost albums so hopefully this one doesn't join. I'm being honest with you. Like, do you I'm think just, it will though? No, I don't think so. There's yeah. well, I know I can. It, it, it's tough. 
It cannot. It, it's tough. Like I, I don't want to believe it, but I mean, like that again. <laughs> there's a whole discography of these albums and projects that were once supposed to come out, and the album just wasn't ready, and it doesn't end up coming out. So, what so. do you think happens now? Like that, that, that's the bottom line. What's happening now? Is this thing dropping in the coming days? What's your guess? I'm gonna wait for after the rave. Wait for after the rave, and then I think I'm gonna get an official word after that, probably. Yeah. And then you're going to see probably someone talk from the Easy Camp or a producer saying like, oh, well, Kanye maybe needs some time to be able to finish the project. That's probably my guess. But we're going to see because the rave still like, I guess at the time that, yeah, like it still has to go down, right? So Absolutely. And what's we have very, to wait on it. What's very interesting, too, is that Ty Dolla Sign himself posted up the pre-save. So that kind of points to the fact that it truly was the plan for this album to come out at midnight December 15th or at least sometime during this day. But... Like we saw in October, they're not afraid of, uh, of canceling events. Like in October, there was supposed to be the multi-stadium listening events across Europe and a bunch of different cities, and that ended up getting canceled. So the point is, is that everything's up for the taking. Everything's up for grabs. We don't know what day this album's going to fall on, but my guess would be if it doesn't surface on like a random Tuesday at 6 a.m., like we saw with Donda, which came out, I think, on a random Sunday. Sun Sunday um, morning, 7.45. Exactly. So I think that's a possibility. It drops on a random day that wasn't even uh, mentioned or maybe next Friday. I, I, I do think it is imminent. I do think it's happening like any day now. What tells you that? What what tells There's you? too much of a rollout that's what, going what on. You, that? you have the <sighs> single out. You have all these listening sessions. It's too, like, tangible for it to, like, slip out of our hands at this point, in my opinion. <laughs> my friend, listen, I don't mean to disappoint you, but it would be a very disappointing day to see this happen. I'm being honest with you. And, I, like I said, I'm the most optimistic guy in the world. Like, I really want to see this happen. You're right. But I just, I don't know. It's 12 a.m., man. <laughs> TikTok. You ever see that meme of the the Spanish announcer for uh, talking about Real Madrid or Barcelona? Hmm. Tick tock. Yeah. <laughs> That's what type of time we're on. So it listen, is. ladies and gentlemen, we don't have an album, but we do have hopes and uh, we do have something that's tangible and that is a rave tonight. So let's see what happens after the rave. You better believe we're going to update you with everything. We wanted to create this video just to give you guys word of something. I mean, most of you guys were probably waiting uh, for this album at 12 a.m. Eastern time like we were. But then again, only a full only wants to see the sunshine you know so mm -hmm. we'll see what happens over this weekend thank you guys so much for watching this video and check out our next update video we'll be back guys peace